false killer whales are large toothed dolphins with a long and slender body. They're commonly called blackfish, along with five other species of dolphins, including pilot whales. They have a round, conical head and a skull shape that's similar to a true killer whale's. Their pectoral fins, or flippers, have a distinctive hump or bulge in the middle of the front edge. Their bodies have a dark coloration, with light patches near the throat and middle chest. They are very social animals that form strong bonds with each other. In Hawaii, they hunt for food in subgroups that usually contain just a few individuals. These subgroups later gather into large groups of up to 35 animals, averaging 16 animals. They're highly intelligent and known to cooperatively hunt for and share their food. Watch this pod of false killer whales pass their marlin catch to each other. There are three populations of false killer whales in Hawaii. Pelagic or open ocean, northwestern Hawaiian islands, and main Hawaiian islands insular populations. The main Hawaiian islands population is listed as endangered under the Endangered Species Act. Estimates suggest that this isolated population has only about 150 individuals left in the wild. All three populations face numerous threats such as marine debris, pollutants, and fisheries interactions. Individuals in the pelagic population are well known to try to take bait or catch from longlines. They occasionally get hooked and can even drown during the attempt. Interactions with fisheries can also damage the mammal's dorsal fins. NOAA Fisheries established the False Killer Whale Take Reduction Team to address the bycatch, death, and serious injuries of whales in longline fisheries. Based on recommendations from the team, NOAA Fisheries established measures to reduce fisheries-related harm to the false killer whales. Researchers used satellite tags to better understand the false killer whale movement and habitat use. False killer whales can move great distances in a short amount of time. These red dots represent daily, satellite-derived locations of one tagged false killer whale. This animation shows an adult male's movement over 52 days, at 12-hour time steps. This quick movement can make them very difficult to find and study. Nonetheless, NOAA fisheries scientists and others will continue to study them helping to better understand their biological needs and threats and ensure their survival in the waters around Hawaii.